kind of tightness and so we want to offer this song as a way to loosen and this is our Shabbat gift to you the words are simple loosen loosen baby you don't have to carry the weight of the world in your muscles and bones let go let go let go Shabbat. Hope you are too. Shabbat Shalom, and you may have noticed that there's not just two of us. Did you notice? I of course, hope so. <laughs> of course you noticed. How could you not? This is McKidley Edelman, new-ish to Temple Micah, 
and to the Micro Storefront Project, and uh, we're happy that you're with us. Yeah, so Shabbat happy. Shalom. Shabbat Shalom. You might see uh, McKinley and um, and her husband Alex and her baby Molly at a storefront event um, coming up. Make sure that you say hi, and thanks for singing with us. Thanks for having me. Yeah, thanks for singing with us. Shabbat Shalom, everyone. Shabbat, Shabbat Shalom. shalom. Scoot, scoot, scoot. Uh, let's keep singing. Yeah, great. to feel a little bit of Shabbat. It's taking yeah. me longer than normal. You kabbalat it, you had to receive it? Like it's like the 24-7 world is, is like attacks us. So it's like, um, it can feel hard to wind down or to know how to wind down. Mm -hmm. And it's like, give yourself the permission to say, okay, like not everything's done, mm -hmm. but I can still stop. The 24-7 world works against that. Yeah, like your, your inbox will be there tomorrow. <laughs> It'll be there always. That's the thing. It's yeah. always there. <laughs> right, but you can say. It's hard to say, but Shabbat at least tells us, like... Take a break. Break. Take a break. Loosen. Take a break. Loosen. Loosen. <laughs> totally. Uh, Shabbat's also a time to give a little hug. Maybe more than one. Maybe two or three to somebody special. Sounds good to me. You can give a little hug to somebody special, and then you can say... Shabbat Shalom. Shalom. Give a little hug to someone special. Give a little hug. Shabbat Shalom. Give a little hug to someone very special. Give a little hug and say.
So give a give massage to, to someone, someone sitting in front of you. Give a little massage and say. because it's not the best idea for us to all be gathering in one space. And in a lot of ways, it feels like time is repeating, mm. going over and over. And I think, about, I think about two things. Where we're at in the Torah right now is the Exodus, when the Israelites get freed from Egypt. And this part of the Torah teaches us two things. One, it takes four chapters for the Israelites to be freed from Egypt like four weeks of readings of the Israelites to be freed from Israel, from Egypt into Israel. And even then they don't get to Israel, right? They're free, but they don't get to go. Which I think tells us that freedom, getting over a place where we are constricted and we're looking for expansiveness, takes a very long time. And you never probably get there. Yeah, like we have to, and, and we read this part of the Torah every year. So there's always this cycling of coming back. Our goal is to, instead of returning to exactly where we came, I think to spiral, to evolve and to grow and know that maybe next year we can be more free mm. and more free and more free. And even as we see circumstances returning, we have to notice like, how are we different? Mm. How have we grown? Like how have we changed? Um, how mm. is this not March, 2020? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Well, I'm less frustrated, you know, more patient, all those things. You? Uh, I, think I, was, I was kind of being facetious. Yeah, um, I have more kind of acceptance, I think. Like, I'm equally as frustrated, but I'm not trying to fight it anymore. Yeah. It just is what it is. It is what it is. Um, and, 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 and no matter what, every week there's Shabbat. Every That's week kind of been Shabbat. my pace. Six days and then Shabbat. Six days and then Shabbat. You can do anything for two minutes at a time, right. one day at a time, six days at a time, as long as we get to stop and just be. So let's uh, take some breaths, take some space, and join in a prayer of oneness, of unity. Shema.
Shabbat Shalom. Shabbat Shalom. Remember to lucid. Peace.